Hey everyone, it's Rad, and I want to thank Keen for they are the sponsor of this video. And don't skip ahead, for I do have a special and exciting announcement to uh, make, including a very, very special gift for anyone who is watching, which I will get to it a uh, soon. For those who doesn't know Keen, this amazing website provides you with an access to a vetted psychics, spiritual advisors who can provide a guidance and insight in into life's challenges, into clarity in love, into relationships, and as well into career and, and many, many more. And Keen, it is a one of the most uh, affordable way to get an instant psychic reading with a professional at any time, 24 seven. What I love about Keen is that it is perfect for anyone who wants to talk with someone right away, anytime, anywhere there is no wait and it is excellent if you do have a burning question that literally needs an answer right now and it is double perfect for if you are on a budget too and here is where my gift for you guys is coming in for anybody who wants to talk with advisor on keen just click my link in the description down below and you get a 10 minutes for just only two dollars and just see for yourself for i do support keen and i have been around the block a lot when it comes to um psychics readers and especially prophets and i can tell you that there are those who are false but uh judging by the way keen found me i can tell you that they are venting their uh advisors uh, very carefully and you i do encourage you to try it out especially if you do have questions that i cannot answer like for example about health like for example about a reallocation because tarot is just not designed for that uh, for example as well yes or no questions as well guys it's only two dollars for 10 minutes and i cannot think of a better way to try it out and uh, get the clarity you seek so there are a uh, tarot readers, psychic readers, uh, love and relationship advisors, and as well spiritual advisors there. Uh, and you can take your time to make a selection of the reader of your choice, establish a bond, which is going to establish as well a goal, be it a uh, intention setting, be it a, a chakra clearing, be it healing, manifesting, and many, many more. And what is also amazing there is that Keen provides every customer of theirs with a monthly discount, which is a um, clearly a way to show you that they do appreciate you being there and it also provides you with a way to afford multiple readings should you need so the signing up process very simple i'm gonna show you how all that you have to do is just watch my screen very few simple clicks for their website it is made intuitively and it's just you cannot get it wrong and just in these few simple clicks you are get yourself ready to make your selection of uh, readers and dive into your spiritual journey right away so to use my gift just click in the link in the description box and get your 10 minutes with a keen advisor of your choosing for just only two us dollars and and see for yourself how amazing they really are with the variety of their uh, advisors and as well the prices which have a ton of variety too should you be on a budget thank you keen for sponsoring this video all right, Gemini, so this is going to be your uh, April reading. And uh, if you do enjoy the, the content here on the channel, guys, and you do wish to support us, just uh, leave a like, subscribe, uh, hit the notification bell so you do not miss any of our uh, videos and as well uh, live streams. And uh, with that said, let me just cut the cards and uh, see what you have for the month itself. So the first one, uh, that is going to be the chariot here, followed by uh, the second card of the ace of swords. Uh, moving next, uh, that is going to be the five of uh, the five of wands. And the final one for you, the final prime card for you, that is going to be the four of uh, 
the three of wands i'm sorry so the additional cards uh, this is the nine of pentacles it kind of like makes a lot of sense now uh then it is the five of swords uh, the five of pentacles oh you do have a lot to struggle against yourself here okay that that is going to be an internal battle we do have um uh, let's check it out six of one six of cups yeah and the seven of cups great at least the final cards are a great but yeah we do have an internal struggle we can see it here with the ace of swords and the five of uh, five of pentacles it is just um it will be a severe conflict with the style you are having your life into uh maybe your life right now you do have way too many problems in order to take on this amazing proposal that we can see here with the uh, chariot and the nine of pentacles so that here it's um oh, the only thing that i can interpret these cards it is a huge proposal coming your way whether on for a new job or just some kind of a romance with, with romantic incentive okay but when that uh, proposal come about comes about uh, you are going to feel extremely unprepared in fact uh, it will feel like it could have not been a worst timing where that proposal to come about and that is because of these two cards the ace of swords and the five of pentacles falling in a position what holds you back what holds you back it is the um uh, how can i put it into words the sight the view that you do have upon your current situation finding it completely incompatible with uh, the uh, unfoldment of the uh, of the proposal that you are gonna get that proposal comes from the job or from the person what i mean it is that such an individuals or such a job it's not coming around lightly it is just not just because you know they are great as benefits but also because such kind of a things they completely fit within our understanding of what is best for us okay for example the job is going to be everything you have ever wanted or the person that approaches you is going to be a person that you have ever wanted or at least for that stage of your life <clears throat> is going to be looking like that way and uh as a as a side note here okay or as a uh, collateral how can i put it into words uh as a as a collateral result you are gonna feel very very proud of yourself i mean it is it is like it's going to flabbergast you it's gonna hit you in a such a way that although right now you may have real trouble to take advantage of that to be a part of it you will feel extremely proud that you have been approached by the person or or by the business okay and that is going to boost your self-confidence a big time but make no mistakes here because we do have these two cards you can and you should by the way is going to be very i don't want to say the word but missing it because you are feeling unconfident and because you right now you do think that you do have way too many problems in order to take advantage of it in other words it's not a good time but let me tell you a secret here for such an opportunities there is never a good timing of them okay you just have to close your eyes and just make a move or just make a step forward toward them uh so it will be a real shame or rather like it will be a real pity it will be such a loss if you do not take advantage of uh, uh of that proposal because like i said make no mistake this is here a wish fulfillment okay wishful to have a lucrative job wishful to have a really functional relationship wishful to have a really steady marriage for example whatever your wish is but because it's manifesting through the chariot card it means that you really have have to put the efforts okay it's not gonna work on its own okay it's just it is something that it will feel overwhelming okay it will feel overwhelming as a an opportunity but should you uh, have the, the the iron will and the, the, the determination to push through it you can 
do it. And uh, by the way, once you set a motion here to, uh, to, to of a manifestation, things are going to become easier and easier with time. It is just that's the nature of the Nine of Pentacles as a catalyst to the, uh, to the Chariot card. The only thing or the hardest thing you got you have to overcome throughout the month it is just to determine that i want to do it and make the first steps that 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 is the hardest thing that you gotta do and after that it's going to be like a snowball it's just one thing is gonna uh, is gonna lead to another and so on and so forth until you actually see it almost done by the end of the month okay and i'm saying almost because there will be still some aspects that has to be um, finalized but for the most part you will have it as solid as you can have so let's focus on the uh, what holds you back here we do have these two cards and they kind of like uh, points uh, to a couple of things one is actually really good that is that you do have a sober understanding how you are where you are at right now in term of your uh, in term of your life you you have a pretty accurate diagnosis uh, what you are capable of you do have a pretty accurate diagnosis what you are facing in front of you so you're not underestimating nor uh, un underestimating nor un uh, nor how can i put it into words nor nor over exaggerating aspects of your life whether in love or whether in career and due to that you are finding that you do have a problems at many fronts now these problems they don't have to be something big okay they may be just the trifles maybe you do have a problem to fit something into your schedule you know maybe you do have problem but you do have too many things at your hands but these problems they are counteracting here the uh, the proposal the opportunity <clears throat> And thus, like I said, makes you, uh, it is leaving you with the impression that, you know, it's not a good time. This month, it's not a good month for you to buy yourself a car, for example, if that's a really, really good um, uh, offer to buy a car or to buy yourself a house or just to start a job. Uh, whatever but what you're not taking under consideration here is that these problems are with a domestic nature what i mean is that these are the they are part of life they are not something you're not going to face all the time it is just something contiguous and you you resolve one of them another one pops up and that's why i'm i'm telling you guys this is where you think that that is not a good time but what the cards are showing is that there is never a good time for such things. You just have to close your eyes, gnash your teeth, put your iron will and determination that you want to do it and just do it. Okay. And once you do, once you adopt that mindset, then things are going to snowball. And like I said, one thing is going to lead to another and just things are going to start happening to you. So you can expect if you are determined, okay and active you can expect huge improvement career wise and, and love lives as well in fact these cards are speaking for humongous a leap into development in either of the two or in both of these depending on what situation you're finding yourself through the month of uh, of april uh what is going to help you here it's a really good thing now that is a resilience to do what it's necessary here five of wands and the six of cups that is where you it's not going to be about pleasure for you to do performance is going to be all about results and sometimes you may find yourself that you have to do things you are finding no pleasure into but because you are going to understand which is the positive side of the negative side here the uh, ace of swords but, but because you're going to understand that they are necessary okay they are necessary to push your um uh, to push your opportunity forward you are going to do them without much thinking about it or without having too much of a uh, negative uh, how can i put it into words ne negative experience from them just to give you an example of it maybe you are finding very unpleasant you know to seek out somebody but because you know it's necessary you have to do it and you're just doing it without giving a second thought into it without overthinking it so to speak but also these two cards here are are showing that throughout the months you will also gonna have that um, acute sense 
of how to tackle with unpredicted or rather like with sudden uh, with sudden turnarounds and as well with with certain surprises certain problems that you have not foreseen beforehand and it is just wh whenever something comes up your way you know you're just gonna have that uh, that awareness how to deal with it right there on spot which is gonna make you a fantastic crisis uh, manager although you may not have to deal with the crisis throughout the month should some of you you know find themselves into tiny bit of such a uh, such an environment or such a situation you will have no problem with it whatsoever and uh, it is just these two cards here are showing that you will have the awareness that sometimes uh, for the greater good you have to do what you have to rather than what you want to and you will have no problem doing it whatsoever but you are uh, actually finishing here the month with the three of wands and the seven of cups which correlates with uh, with the start and uh, these cards are showing a really huge progress that you are going to do now uh, because the seven of cups it's uh, it's an enemy to the three of wands it kind of shows that y your results are going to be tangible and uh, these tangible results actually are going to sit on a, a really established pattern so you can expect a severe progress for example should that be a job and you have been asked to just being on a trial by the end of the month uh, the business that you are working for probably is going to propose you a, a, a contract a permanent contract I'm sorry uh, should that be for example a, a dating offer by the end of the month you are to see yourself that you are pre uh, uh, constant with with these dates in fact together you are almost together if not together and making plans for the future now the only problem with these two cards it is that in such a carefree state that um, that enterprise here can go just as far and from there on moving forward you just have to make some kind of a challenge for yourself you know you got to challenge yourself to go for a bigger project for example or you got to challenge yourself to start living with a person that you are dating and so on and so forth the good thing is that you can maintain these solid patterns here and stable foundations for as long as you are comfortable in them so that challenge doesn't have to happen right away at the end of the month okay it can happen two months from now or it can happen two years from now you get to choose when you want to and that gives another incentive here that actually the how far is going that enterprise to develop and how fast it is entirely within your hands and entirely within your comfort zone but don't allow you know domestic things domestic problems that anyone experienced to really ruin that proposal which is coming your way so with that said uh gemini that was your monthly reading hopefully you do enjoy it and you do like it guys and we uh are to see each other next time until then bye